Hello everyone. Today we want to show you how we can use a array search instruction. Array search. For example, you have a array. Here I will write a variable. Array. For example, array one. And the type of this is uh, array of boolean, for example. And the dimension is, uh, for example, four, mem three, uh, four member. Here, I will write like as this and also here I will give a array array but I want uh, say to array search the first member that I want for example I want to start searching from the first member also here we can specify how many members of this array to search for example I want search in all member because of this I will write four because my uh, array has a four member and here i will say to array search for this key for example search for true and here the array search give us the position of the uh, find member for example i will write found member and here the array search will give us how many members is true because we are uh, searching for true members. And here we have a result, true or false result. Okay. And also here, x array. For example, x1, array x2 for testing, array x3, array x4, here I will write array 1, 0, simulation run here as you see array search uh, don't finding any true value in the array because of this the result is false also we can view from the watch tab page uh, view watch tab page table array one as you see all member all four member is false because of this the result is false quantity of true is zero and the position is zero so for example i will turning on this member as you see the result is true yeah, the array search find one member with true value one member with true value and the position of this true value is three zero one two three zero one two three for example i will turn off this and turn on this value as you see, the quantity is 1 and the position is 2. If I will turn on 2 value, it said found quantity is 2, but the found position is 1. Uh, 0, 1, 2. Yes, here 2, pos two member is true, but this uh, instruction give you the first position, the first position that found the true value. And also, uh, you can do this with the simulation with any of array for example here I will write another I will create another uh, array for example ary int for example array zero four zero three 
of int. Okay. And here I will write this section move array int zero. For example, here int ten. Twenty, thirty, and forty. Array zero, one, two, and three. Okay, and here I will write this function, this instruction again. And also, I will rename this ints. Here, I will give array int this array, the first array, the first member of this array. And also, I will say to him, I want search in four member, 0, 1, 2, 3. The k is my k. I will write a R Y my K. The type is int because we are search searching the array int font find position. I will add an int here, for example, int here and also int. Okay, now we will go for simulation. Okay, as you see all here. We have 10, 20, 30, 40. And uh, result is false because I am searching for 0 and none of them is 0. For example, if I will write here 40, you can see the result true. Uh, he said it said uh, the array search found a member, found, found quantity, one member find with 40. And the position is 3, 0, 1, 2, and 3. If I will write here, for example, 20, no, the result is true. Found member is 1, and the found position is 1. And also, for example, if I will change it to 20, As you see, the find quantity is two. His this uh, instructions say I will I found two member that has this value twenty. For example, uh, you can use this command for the alarm section. If you use an array for alarms and each member of an array is one of your alarms, every time the output of this instruction is turned on. It means that an alarm has occurred and you can use this output for example to send into HMI and also use in your program. Thank you for watching this video. Goodbye.